My name is Erin Brewer, Thank and I, um, I represent myself. And I want to reiterate again, um, I was insistent, consistent, and persistent with my identity as not being a girl. Um, I listened to these stories of these parents, and it could have been me. I was so adamant that I was a boy. Um, because of this, my first grade teacher, Ms. Hicken, at Howard R. Driggs Elementary School, asked the school psychologist to evaluate me. Um, rather than affirming that I was a boy, the school psychologist came up with a few simple recommendations for my teacher and parents to help me alleviate the hatred I had for my body, and I am forever grateful to her. These recommendations included very simple things like reinforcing positive ideas of being a girl, exposing me to talented women. I was put in a group of children with behavior problems to learn better communication skills. Just like the kids you've heard described, I was angry. I was hitting my teachers. I was kicking other students. I was a behavior problem. And it wasn't because I was born in the wrong body. It was because I had a deep-seated trauma that I needed help with. If I had been medically transitioned, I never would have understood that that hatred for my female body was a result of being violently violated. I am so thankful to the school psychologist for putting me on this healing path. And it just disturbs me to the core that any of these children think that we're up here trying to propose this legislation because we don't care about them. We're here because we love them. And some of us know exactly what it feels like to have that hatred and to have that shame and to want to be something else other than yourself. And we're here to tell you that you can survive yourself and you can make it into adulthood without damaging your healthy body and without per basically killing who you are and becoming another person. Trans activists insist that using ex experimental medical interventions on children with gender dysphoria is appropriate. It is not. It is medical abuse and we need to protect these children. Thank you very much.